Are we hoping that the wedding bells will ring anytime soon? Definitely. Oh, I want that. Ah, ah, you. <laughs> These guys are just too dramatic. Question here is Are you happy in this relationship? <laughs> Has he arrived or you are still, still in the process? We are still in the process, sir. <laughs> Mr. Fufu is the most unluckiest person in this show. <laughs> Are you guys good? Um, we are, I mean, we're good. Mm. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it is the Finding Love Show Season 3, and for tonight, it's going to be the last night for a whole lot of people in the house. Of course, whatever has a beginning has an end. And for tonight, it's going to be the end of the beginning for a whole lot of housemates. And I mean, some housemates will mean transit to next week where it will be an end for them as well. But ladies and gentlemen, first of all, all the couples are looking very awesome tonight. A round of applause for yourselves. <laughs> so I am very sure you want to see what they look like. And trust me, you're going to see them. And let's see the couples you think you love best. So ladies and gentlemen, let's start with the one you call Trans Limao. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is looking like a, um, a Pluto king and um, a Jesus baby. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, before I speak with them, let me also invite, I think for us, one of the most dramatic and lovable couples we have in the house, Awesome Maggie! I also feel like um, the Edo brothers are coming out with their last shots because it's a Pluto night for them. <laughs> and the ladies are all coming out in their dinner gowns. All right, so um, yesterday, or last night perhaps, we asked um, the Osemekis um, who is going to be relocating, yeah. um, who is leaving Lagos to uh, Ekoma, who is leaving Ekoma to Lagos. And we had a lot of hiccups here and there. So let's find out from you who is living amongst you both, who is going to relocate to the other person's location. Um, I don't think that should be a challenge for us. Okay. Because uh, what she does, it's, uh, how do I put it, self? A lot of different varieties do, but you can control them from anywhere. Mm. She can be in Edo State on a Lagos money and stuff. The same thing with me. Okay. Sure anyone works for us. Anyone works? Yeah. Or you guys are going to be doing shifts? So I'm going to make work. I'm going to make work. Yes, wow, wow, wow. Now that's a couple. <laughs> No, you must come to Vinny. No, you must come to Lagos. No, you must. If I must come to Vinny, you will pay me. You don't see your mates? Okay. So now, before I um, talk with them, um, let's find out what's next for you guys. Tonight, um, we are wrapping up the show. What's next for you guys? Um, are we hoping that the wedding bells will ring anytime soon? Definitely. Oh, I want that. Ah, ah. You... <laughs> These guys are just too dramatic. Okay, I thought she wanted to say, like, oh, how? And she said, oh, I want that. And you know when the guest starts with, oh. <laughs> if there's anything you don't, don't play with, when you hear, oh. <laughs> My brother, you are one of the luckiest man I've seen. Thank you, sir. Okay, let me hear from um, Osemeki. This one, both of them are folding their hands like this. <laughs> is it that the AC is too cold or something? Yes, sir. Okay, let me hear from you. you you're looking very cold today. Are you emotional that you're leaving the house already? So, um, what could be it? Why, why are you so quiet? Or has he, has he started again? No, not at all. Not at all? Yes, sir. All right. So, the question here is, are you happy in this relationship? <laughs> I don't know how to answer this question. Okay. Ose, let's hear from you. So I don't want people to see because you your own is too much. You start saying, that's how you force so Odogo and Namara. Now they're always doing bass boots, bass boots. I don't want to be involved in any bass boots. They want, that's uh, Becky and uh, Mr. Fu, you have finished me already. So I don't even want to put myself in this thing again. <laughs> Anybody that does not want, it's finding love show. It's not a must. Uh, Ose, yes, sir. are you happy in this relationship? Uh, I was happy and I'm still happy. And you will still be happy? Definitely. Okay. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, that was Osemegi and Translima. You guys can go back to your seat. I will call you guys for your personal talks very soon. You, ladies and gentlemen, are you not putting your hands together for them? 
Okay, the funniest couples in the house, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Fufu and Becky. These ones, I don't even know what they are doing here. I need couples of bestie. A round of applause for them, please. <laughs> and while you're stepping forward, allow me to introduce the most controversial of them all, Badafe and Igwe Biwai. Okay, so... Um, so usually in our last nights of the show, um, we see a lot of emotions, people who still enjoy the show, they don't want to go and all of that. But in this time, yeah, we still see that emotion, but this time something different, like everybody's just happy and smiling, like we cannot wait to go and start our life after the show. All right. Um, how is it going? Uh, yes, last night you told us that you were close. I mean, you were close, that he's getting near, he, that you, he'll soon come. So the question now is, has he arrived or people are still still in the process? Yes, still in the process, sir. <laughs> Mr. Fufu is the most unluckiest person in this show. <laughs> okay. Mr. Fufu? Sir. Still in the process, she said. Um, what do you think? Um, what's your response? Um, boss. Mr. Fufu, you have started with this thing again. <laughs> <laughs> Always crashing. My sister is good, though. <laughs> this is why you are running like this wrong way. Because... <laughs> You've been scratching as well. Okay. Boss, actually, it's just that I have been asking her to just accept my proposal so that everything will go well and smoothly for us. But it's just um, Becky Brown, her, still don't want to accept it. But she says she's cool with the best friendship. And I'm also cool. Okay. It for now, maybe as time goes on, we'll build up something. Okay, that's fine. That's yeah, fine. I mean, thank you. I mean, I appreciate and respect your opinion, guys. Um... Uh uh, you know. Um, anytime I see Valdi, uh, uh, you know, there's this um, stuff we used to talk about Big Brother. That uh, Big Brother had um, a special affection for uh, um, T Boss. So you can call everybody, come to the diary room. But as soon as it gets to T Boss time, you hear T Boss, T Boss, <laughs> come to the diary room, <laughs> and they will never show what Big Brother and T Boss are saying. So Valdi. Bound affair. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, she's one of my favorite housemates. Uh, Bound affair. What's happening in your relationship? Because your relationship now, even Nepa, is more, is more constant. We at least understand Nepa. Your fluctuation is getting too much. Are you guys good? Um, we are, I mean, we're good. Mm. You know, um, after the whole saga. Saga shows things. moments. And coming back together, we've been trying to work things out. Um, it's just taking a turn that we both spoke about and it's not looking promising. It's not looking promising, but trust me, Igwe BY might just make it look promising. Let me hear from Igwe BY. Igwe BY, this is your dressing. You're a real, which state are you from again? From Nigeria State. <laughs> <laughs> Igwe, Igwe, trust me, even all cowboys, they don't dress like this, but I mean, bad affair, I'm, I'm glad you like it, you just love him the way he is. So, you heard that, it's not looking too promising. Um, for you, um, what do you think? What's your take on that? Okay, my take on that, um, <laughs> me, I, to me, it's looking promising, but I wonder why she said it's not looking promising to her, because I still want her the most. Mm. Mm. Can somebody say, mm. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, these are the four surviving couples in the house. And of course, like I said, some people will be living the house as couples, while some people will be served breakfast. But I pray that the people who we think will be serving themselves breakfast should not actually serve themselves breakfast. At the meantime, I'm going to be bringing up the couple now, one after the other, so we can have the final talks with each of the couple and find out how they are going to be doing and if they are going to be living together. And if not, why? And if why, what next for them? At the meantime, guys, just wait because we are now bringing the couples one after the other to tell you exactly how they'll be living the house. It's the last day of the Finding Love Show season three. And trust me, we are going to break your hearts. Thank you. All right, you may have your seat. A round of applause for all the surviving couples. And the one that is so painful to me is Mr. Fufu. Like, 
my condolence goes to Mr. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So watch out for the next um, videos because now you'll be seeing the people who are going back home. Please tell me, in your opinion, who do you want to go back home together as couples? Is it the trans Limao talking about transformer and Limao? Or is it the Ose Megi talking about Ose and Megi? Or is it Igwe Biwai and Bao Affair? Or is it going to be um, um, Becky Brown and, of course, Mr. Fufu? Who do you want to go back together and who do you want to separate in the show? Let's find out in the next video. Make sure you watch and share.